Good morning, everybody. Welcome to Reading the Red, this beautiful, sunny, sunny Monday morning. Wonderful. And uh, I've come back refreshed and ready to go again after a wonderful holiday break in Cornwall. So, uh, Mark chapter 4 and verse 5. Other seed fell on the rocky ground where it did not have much soil and immediately it sprang up because it had no depth of soil. So because it never had a long way to travel down, it was able to grow up quicker. And sometimes we see things and they we just give a little bit and then all of a sudden we see something appear and we think, wow, that's really happening. And we should actually recognize the warning signs when we see that happening, because it's usually a flash in the pan, we used to say, this kind of outburst of excitement, but then it just withers away. And if we don't go down deep, and the seeds and the roots don't go down deep, then we will have insufficient soil to grow. And so it might seem like it's a really good response that we get in. But the fact is that it's not going to last. It's not how we start the race that's important. <clears throat> it's how we finish the race. And I've seen it time and time and time again. Many people become Christians and they seem like they're going to run forever as fast as they possibly can. But five minutes down the road, they're just bent over wondering what they get where they're going to get their next breath from. It's not about a flash in the pan. Christianity isn't about a flash in the pan. It's about going deep. And as the word of God goes deep into our being, it will produce the produce of its kind. So if you want the peace of God, then you need to take on board the revelation of what Jesus said with regards to the peace of God. If you want the love of God, then you need to take on board what Jesus said with regards to the love of God. If you want the joy of the Lord, if you want the favour of the Lord, if you want the blessing of the Lord, they're all seeds that you can sow in the innermost being of your hearts. But if it doesn't go deep into the innermost being, it just stays on the shallow surface, you might get an instant response, but it won't last. Brothers and sisters, we need to go deep if we want to sustain this life with God in relevance. Thank you for joining me. Be blessed. Have a great, great day and I'll see you tomorrow. Go deep.